It is college game day, Nordian fans. Oh, yeah. Now, in this matchup, Nordian versus USC. Now, these two schools have a lot of history, okay? USC won national championships back in the day. Same thing for Nordian. Nordian had not reached the championship in a while. They got there, but they never won it. Okay. Last time they got to the national championship was 2012, the undefeated season. But they got their ass whooped that championship game. That really makes me mad because I love Notre Dame. I support them ever since I was a teenager. And these two schools, you know, Notre Dame beat USC one year. On the other hand, a UFC beat Notre Dame. I think on each other field. I'm not really too sure. Um, I love this matchup, and this can be awesome. Notre Dame is ranked 14. I am so glad that Notre Dame beat Navy last Saturday. Navy is a very um, decent school, young. I think at one time that uh, Navy beat Notre Dame in the regular season, I'm not really too sure. On the other hand, USC is not even ranked. They are 3 and 2. Hopefully, Notre Dame does not get upset in this game. So, I see you later. But before I go, Notre Dame fans, go Irish! Hopefully, the whole team clicks like, like a snap. I like Notre Dame. I will never ever um, lose um, faith in this team. Have a good one. Talk to you later. Go Notre Dame once again. There goes the kick. The kick of the game. Come on Irish. Get him. Yes. Go Irish. Yeah. It's half time. Notre Dame fans is all tied up at 24. Right before halftime, the kicker for USC missed it. He clanked it because the coach for Notre Dame used all his timeouts. So he frees the kicker, and I guess the kicker lost concentration. So that is the halftime score, all tied up at 24. But let me discuss about the first quarter. Notre Dame scored 21 points in six plays. That's awesome. Huge plays. I remember one huge play. The quarterback threw a 75-yard bomb. That was freaking awesome. And like I mentioned earlier, that U U C S sorry U S C and Notre Dame have a huge rivalry. Okay. And let's see if this continues. Last year, Notre Dame got killed out there in California. Can Notre Dame get revenge on this team? And um, in the second quarter, um, I don't know when this happened, but UCS, US, sorry, USC did an awesome lateral, and they got a touchdown, and Notre Dame defense just got baffled, so really, and they were keep creeping back, and they got back in this game, and... It's tied up at 24, and that sucks. I thought Notre Dame is going to blow the doors off this game. But it does not look like it right now. So, I see you guys after the game. But before they go, like I usually do, go Irish. I hopefully, they step on their offense, their defense, and make some great plays. Have a good one. And once again, go Notre Dame.
We're getting ready to kick off the second half. Boom! Kamirish makes some plays. Go, go, go. Uh, that's not that bad. Go Irish, second half. That's it. Notre Dame wins. Go Irish. Yes. Woohoo. They won by 10. Yes. Woohoo. Yes. Notre Dame wins. 41 to 31 over the rivalry. U.S.C. Way to go, Irish. Now, it's like a back and forth kind of game. Then the second half. Notre Dame just blew them out of the water. Late in the third quarter or the beginning of the third quarter. I don't remember. I really enjoyed this game. It was freaking awesome. And whew, look at it. They scored um, in the fourth quarter 17 on answer points. That is freaking awesome. Um, yeah, it was a very tight game. The first two quarters in the first half, then USC, sorry, USC scored um, late in the third, and they got 30 to 24. Then they, um, then Notre Dame got it early in the fourth quarter, tied it, took the lead. Make it 31 to 30. Then it was 31. It was tied again, 31, 31. Then Notre Dame took the lead again, 37, 31. Then they they extended it, 36 and 38, 31. Then the final score, 34, no, 30, 41, 31. I mean 41 to 31, up by 10. So that is awesome. Quarterback for Notre Dame, 15 out of 24, 227 yards, two TDs. His longest pass was 75 yards. Uh, Fuller, three receptions for 131 yards, one TD. So overall, they did a good job. Notre Dame is 6-1 on the season. So the next opponent will be uh, this Saturday coming up, October 31st. Is it this Saturday? Sorry, they got a bye week. Um, they don't play this week. They play in the following week. October 31st is the next opponent. Um, let me see if it's on the road or home. I think it's the road. Okay, it's at Temple. They should beat them. And then they're, they're on the road back to back weeks. Then uh, the following week will be November 14th against Wake Forest. So hopefully we can beat them. And then. November 21st is Senior Day. Hopefully you could beat them in the big game. November 28th, Stanford. So I don't know if Notre Dame is going to move up in the rankings in the top 25. So have a good one. I'm glad Notre Dame won. I'm glad Notre Dame blocked that punt earlier in this game. And I would just wish they didn't give up big plays. But whatever. But I'm glad they're off. They can rest their players. Some of them are, I think, injured. So have a good one, and one more thing before I let you go, Notre Dame fans, go Irish. See you next Notre Dame video, and that will be after the bye week.